Hi again, it's Richard Suertudo with The Paper Eye. Today we're continuing our series on Robert Crumb's various forms of art that he's been involved in since his career started in the mid-1960s. Here we have a book published in 1972 by Bellerophon Books in San Francisco called Eat It. The book was written by Dana Crumb and Sherry Cohen, illustrated throughout by Robert Crumb. It, it's pretty entertaining. They, they do classic dishes from the Midwest, uh, you know, meat, potatoes, that sort of thing. But they, they play around with the titles of the dishes, and Crumb certainly has some interesting little characters that he's added to his little cookbook here. In the middle of the book, there's a series of kitchen cutouts of Crumb which are actually a pretty famous little section that, that is known to the underground art industry. Kitchen cutouts by Crumb. He's taken all of the items you might find in a normal kitchen and he's drawn little characters of them and he's named them snappy little names that are just sort of entertaining. And here we have Beatrice Bread Slice, Dick Tater, Sneaky Pete Pepper Shaker, <laughs> and Sid Spoon, don't forget Sid. So these are obviously, if you wanna purchase this book and, and save it for value, you, you keep the cutouts in the book because you just devalue the heck out of it. But other than that, they're just pretty entertaining. I, I find it entertaining anyway. Chicken a la Golden Post, I don't even really wanna know what that is, but at any rate, and we have the guy right on the back of this. What would he be doing other than burping? Thanks. <laughs>